Hi guys, my name is Kina Jemskal and welcome to a walkthrough of the Back to the Wall quest in Sims Freeplay. This quest becomes available on the 1st of August 2018 and if you come out onto your town map, you will get this pop-up that says Back to the Wall. Complete this quest to unlock the ability to create feature walls. Complete within the time limit to unlock a pack of wallpapers and carpets. So you can choose Not Now or you can choose to visit. So let's go ahead and visit. And it will bring us over to the park. So if you do choose the not now, you can always come back and start this quest by coming over to the park. This is a discovery quest, which means that you can complete it alongside one of the main quests in the game and you choose when to start it. You can't do two discovery quests at the same time, but you have to come over to the park to start it and you will find this lady here that you need to click on to start the quest. She looks very snazzy, right, in that outfit. So let's go ahead and click on her. And this is Back to the Wall, the famous interior decorating magazine. Plush Living has reached out to your sim to be a participant in the interior design competition in Simtown. Your sim will discover the hidden art of creating feature walls and will have a chance to earn brand new wallpapers and carpets. So you can come off of this if you want, if you decide you don't want to start this yet. Or, of course, if you do want to start it, you click on Begin Quest to start the quest. So let's click on Begin Quest, and we have seven days in which to do this. This is a very exciting quest for lots of people who love designing houses, and we are going to be able to, as you can see from that little picture there, do different floors and different walls within one room, which is something that... Is fantastic it's not something that I thought of that I wanted but now it's gonna be in the game it's like yeah of course that's what we want so really excited for this quest so let's get started the first thing is talk to summer feels plush living's editor summer feels is waiting for your sim in the park she's waiting to fill them in on the details of the interior design competition that plush living is running have your sim talk to summer so let's click on summer and no we haven't got anyone over let's call over a sim to the park and then let's click on it and talk is 30 minutes we've finished talking now send a sim home summer explains that plush living has identified the most talented and upcoming interior designers in Simtown. the winner with the most new and unique design will be featured in the next edition in their excitement your sim instantly accepts were they too quick to agree let's go home and think it through send your sim home so if you go into the sim tracker and where is our sim here she is let's click on the go home and that is task complete now we need to panic about competition your sim arrives home and is overcome with fear they have just promised plush living that they would come up with something new and unique what to do Panicking seems like the best course of action. Have your sim panic outside near the letterbox. You can see there's a cross outside, that's where we need to click. So click on there and panic about competition for 1 hour and 15 minutes. Let's see this panic. Oh yeah, she's uh, <laughs> she's freaking out. <laughs> she has finished her panic now. Now she needs to read Inferior Designs magazine. Within their maelstrom of panic, your sim has a moment of clarity. Research will help. Have your sim read interior designs from a magazine stack. Note, magazines can be found in the home store in the living room tab. Okay, so let's, I'm going to have to go and buy a magazine stack because I haven't got any in this house. So living room and stack of magazines. Let's just place that down there. I'm actually over at my chic boutique. There is a tour of, of this up on the channel if you fancy seeing that. So I will leave that in a card up on the screen now so you can check out that tour if you would like back to the quest click on the magazines and inferior designs is two hours and 15 minutes let's click on that and you can start reading that magazine we've finished reading the inferior designs magazine now we need to browse new trends your sim reads inferior designs balconies are the new black futons are the future wait this magazine is 15 years old. <laughs> Maybe looking for trends online is better. Have your sim use a computer to browse new trends. So if you haven't got one, you need to buy one from the electronics tab, which actually I will just go ahead and buy one, I think. We want a three star to do this as quickly as possible. So let's go with this one. And click on the computer and 
browse new trends is two hours, 20 minutes. We have finished on the computer. Now add new flooring. Wow, there are so many cool ideas on the internet. Maybe it's time to put some of this research into action. Your sim should start by putting some new flooring in the house. Place a new flooring into a room in your sim's house. So, just any room here. So if you go into the home store and into the floor section, where is it? Here we go. And just pick any floor and just place it in one of the rooms. There we go, task complete. Now get another sim's opinion. That floor looks very now, but is it enough? Does it even speak to the modern er? Call a sim over to assess the new flooring. Speak to a sim to get their opinion on the new flooring. So let's come out of the home store and we'll call another sim over here. And then get opinion on floors is four hours and five minutes top right there. We have finished getting another sim's opinion. Now we need to contemplate design. Your sim declares that they are flawed by such a flawed design choice. There is nothing original about it at all. With so many ideas out there, how can your sim come up with anything new? Can your sim really do this? What does interior design even mean? On a couch, have your sim contemplate their design. So let's see, is this a three star? This is a three star, yeah. So we can contemplate design for three hours and 40 minutes. That is completed. Now call Summerfields. Your sim contemplates what interior design is, but they are still drawing a complete blank. Perhaps they should call Summer at Plush Living to get clarification on the requirements. Have your sim call Summer on a phone. I've headed over to a house with a phone and let's click on the phone and we need to call Summerfields is 48 seconds. There we go, we've finished our call to Summer. Now we need to wait for Summer to be free. Summer is not answering. Perhaps she's busy at the moment. Have your sim call back in 21 hours and one minute. Ah, okay. So is this a quest where we can't complete it all in... In one go I think it is yeah, so we have to wait 21 hours so yeah if we click on the phone we haven't got the option to call summer so this is a quest where we can't rush it we have to wait and complete a certain amount every day obviously for me it's 21 hours that I have to wait for you it will be different depending on how long it is taking you to complete the first part of the quest I assume we can skip, yes we can skip it, if we want to skip it we can use LPs. Should we skip and complete the whole task? I don't think I'm going to, I think I'm going to wait until tomorrow to be honest. So there we go, there is the first part of this quest, I wasn't expecting that to be honest, I was expecting to be able to go all the way through, so we are 13% done with this quest. I thought I was going to get different walls today and be able to do that, which is a little bit disappointed. But never mind, it's something that to look forward to. I do kind of like these quests, to be honest, an event where we have to wait a short time to complete. I, I don't really like using LPs to speed it up, to be honest. But there we go, there's the first part of the quest. Let me know what you think of this quest, of the prize, of the fact that we have to wait. Like I say, I, I quite like it, but let me know what you think. I would love to hear your thoughts down below in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you tune in tomorrow to watch the next part. And I'll see you then. Bye.